Emily's a good girl. When I first saw her, I realized I was such a fool. A fool for being satisfied by the petty girls from this countryside town. You uh, George, I agree you were a fool. And you are a fool. <laughs> Shut it, York. You're the fool here. Becky, Diane, and Carol. They all died right in front of you. You couldn't save even one of them. Not even one. You're the worthless fool here. And that's what proves it. But me, unlike you, I am strong. I have power. My mother taught me the strong who can overpower others is always correct and right. My mother uh, no. stepped on my face with her stiletto heels because she had power. Damn. And when the heel pierced my cheek, I learned to respect teeth are really Since sharp. Then, I obtained power of my own and found my own disciples. I became divine. All I need now is that goddess of faith and grab her with my hands. I want Emily in her stiletto heels. You're out of your mind. The goddess won't smile for you anymore, George. Deer hunting is great. They can be erotic creatures. What? Black eyes, firm hips, slender legs. Dude! Hunting is a sign of power, especially in deer hunting. Did you know, York, from time to time, as a family of deer that comes down to the graveyard, I shot them full of bullets. They still remain standing. First, I thought they were zombies, but when I snuck up on one, cut its stomach out, I found the truth. The red seeds. Those seeds made those deer invincible. George, no Olympics for you. You'll fail the doping test. <laughs> You'd be good food for wild animals. Anyone could get the and seeds if they want. My divinity. They're freaking all over the graveyard. Incredibly un ew, uncomfortable right now. Ew. Ew, 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 ew. This is the mark my mother gave me. Proof of power. The red tree. The red tree? You've got that all wrong, George. That's the mark of child abuse. Oh, look at you. <laughs> That's no use. Strength. It's surging through my body. I can no longer be killed. We'll see about that. Aren't you honored? You're the first to congratulate for my new powers. Need a zoom in the angle of his crotch, Jesus. <laughs> All right, let's see how hard this fight is on hard.
the trick here is we need he's only vulnerable on the scar on his back. So we need to get behind him. on the ground actually saved me. Woo. Damn it, you almost he wanna say York instead of George. Damn it. Oh stop doing that. Where is he? Find it. <laughs> yeah, bitch. This is so clever. I've got plenty more. Oh shit! You think you're so clever? I do. I've got many more. Whoops. Yeah. Shit. I 
think I did hit him there because purple blood came out. It's like one more hit. Maybe more. Yeah, I got it. Getting Anna and Becky involved was all too easy. Carol and Thomas built a secret club for me. All we had to do was tell them about it, and they were giddy to join us immediately. Because they were dumb. And that's where I used the seeds on Anna and Becky. Amazing results, let me tell you. They went berserk! My cat. This. Anna, especially, enjoyed the seeds. So I made my decision. She would be the first sacrifice for my immortality. George, your poetic prose is a bit confusing. <laughs> Let me reword this so it makes sense. You chose Anna as your first victim, so you could be a first-degree murderer. You go, York! And you framed Thomas so it looked like he did. <laughs> you saw him, didn't you? I'll meet up. He knew that he was only being treated as a substitute for Emily. He knew that. And Carol knew too. But they played along with your sick games. You're just pissing him off, York. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, you're making me cry. Here's the one who told me about the raincoat killer. About how to become divine, too. He didn't believe any of it. But when he told me, it all made sense. Because you're insane! Why was I born in such a run-down dump? Why did my mother beat me every day? Why didn't Emily want me? Power. You look gross, dude. I mean, look at you. Oh, dear. Super Saiyan over nine thousand. <laughs> An imagination like that, you belong in the zoo, the Hollywood Zoo. Look <laughs> how, no matter how batshit crazy stuff goes, he's all like, "Lol, well, I'm gonna make a pun." <laughs> I'm taking serious, York. Shut up. Get all the way over there. Kneel before the stork. I'm not gonna kneel before you. Gross looking. <laughs> Actually, I might have done that wrong. So, second verse, same as the first. We need to get behind him again. Go! What is that it's all not possible for me to die anymore. Oh, shit. You scum. Oh, shit. Run! Uh, 
Okay, good. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. You surprised me. I think you just pushed me. You're so mean, pushing me. Whoa. Oh, I guess that's his aggravated grunt. Oh shit! Uh. Okay. Good. Spot on your back. Control which way he dodges. He just kind of dodges wherever. Oh, bullshit. Oh, no, I did hit him because his bar went down. Gross! Look at you! Mama, I didn't do anything bad. Why? Why are you doing this to me? What are you talking about? It wasn't me! I didn't do anything! You killed four people! I know, but I apologize if I... Yes, you did! What are you talking about? What are you talking I am the chosen 